Hi everyone. While most of us love to relax in the pool, our hair doesn't necessarily love the chlorine-ridden pool water. Pool water is often sanitized using chemicals like sodium carbonate, sodium bicarbonate, sodium bisulfate, calcium chloride among many others. All these chemicals make your hair hard and rough and often induce hair fall. And not just the pool. If you plan to swim in the sea or visit a water park, your hair can equally be damaged. So here is how you can protect your hair while swimming. Prepare your hair before taking a plunge. Detangle and wet your hair with clean water. Hair tend to soak less chemical and salt from the pool when already wet. Use some light oil as argan oil, cold pressed coconut oil or almond oil to make a protective layer on your hair. Oil and water don't mix and this would protect your hair from soaking in the chemicals. Cover your hair lens and the tips with the oil. You can also use a hair serum to coat the tips and the lens of your hair. Before taking a dip, it is advisable to tie up your hair because hey, you would not want your hair to get everywhere and all tangled up. You can pull up all your hair to make a bun. It is so important to tie up your hair and protect it from unnecessarily getting exposed to the sea or pool water. I also like to make such messy braids. These flowers were just so pretty that I ended up tucking them in randomly. It doesn't mean that you have to as well. If you swim or dive too frequently, then probably you should consider wearing a swimming cap like so. It isn't too glamorous to look at. However, your hair would still be safe. Or if you're going for a casual time in the pool, wear a shower cap or a plastic cap instead. After your time in the water, use a shampoo which is specially made to clear out the sea salt and chlorine from the hair. Just in case if you don't have the clarifying shampoo, then squeeze half a lemon in a mug of water and use it as the last rinse after the regular shampoo. Wash off the hair thoroughly with clean water and follow with the conditioner. Keep the conditioner in the refrigerator for 15 minutes before the usage. A cold conditioner nourishes better. If you go in the water very frequently, then use a deep conditioning hair mask at least once a week. It will restore the lost moisture and keep your hair more manageable and smooth. Also, avoid heat drying your hair. Let the hair dry naturally in the air. So these were my quick yet essential pool hair hacks. If you found this video useful, then share it so it may help others. Also, watch my other videos about hair care on my channel. And don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Facebook. See the description box for the details. Subscribe to Hindi videos in Hindi. Subscribe to my Hindi channel.